uh, in this short video we're just going to simplify this set okay so there is what we call a dis distributive law in case you've not come across the laws on set theory watch the video using the link in the description or the tag showing on top okay so we've learned of commutative laws where it doesn't matter what you start with so i can see why complement is common in this case so i can start with it in both brackets and this is exactly what we're going to have so we start with y complement intersection x okay and then we maintain the sign in between which is the intersection and then in the other bracket as well we'll start with y complement intersection x complement so that's what commutative laws tell us so a commutative law tells us say the intersection of a with b is the same as the intersection of b with a okay so it doesn't matter what you start with and the basic idea is because I want to start with y complement since it's common. So according to distributive laws, it implies we add y complement intersection. And then in the brackets, we add x and x complement. So the sign that comes there is what is in between there. So it's intersection x complement. So just to help you understand is... Uh, Distributive laws or a distributive law you can easily remember it by considering the multiplication, right? So it's like you are multiplying this with what is inside there with x and then x complement respectively. What remains there is what is there. Okay. So at that point, uh what you need to understand is the intersection of a set with its complement, the, there is no intersection because it's either you are part of a set or you are outside the set. So there is no intersection. Now, the intersection of any given set with the empty set, there are no common elements between an empty set and a given set, so it's obviously going to be an empty set. However, in cases where we have union, you are combining an empty set with a given set, the answer remains that set. Okay, so that's how you go about this. Thank you very much for watching.